Hello, this is John Calvert from the Clarkstown Central School District, and this is going to be a quick tutorial on creating and customizing a Google chart in Google Spreadsheets. So it's really easy to create and edit a Google Spreadsheets chart. The first thing you need is the data. So in this case, we've collected data from a Google form and then reformatted it uh, to look like this. This is uh, teacher perception of usefulness for different areas in our Google curriculum portal. This data was collected a couple of years ago. Now what I want to do is I want to create some pie graphs to represent this data. So the first thing is to select the data using your mouse. So I'm going to click on the top left of my data, hold the mouse button down, and drag until all of the data that I want to graph is selected. Once your data is selected, your data range, you're going to go to insert, the insert menu on the top left, and you'll scroll all the way down to chart. After you select the data and you select chart, the data range is automatically added to the chart editor. So this is the data that was just selected. Represented here, this is what it will look like in a pie graph, which is perfect. The Google editor uh, will also give me other recommended options. So I could choose a bar graph, either vertical or horizontal, should I choose. I can also switch the rows and columns. In this case, I want the row 3 to be my header, and I want the left column to be my labels. So this is exactly how I want the data represented, but I want a pie graph. Now if you click on the Charts tab on the top left, you can change this chart to other available options. Maybe I want a scatter plot or a trending graph. Trending graphs are interesting because you can actually animate them. You can add a uh, time component. I simply want a pie graph, but I'll make it a 3D pie graph to make it a little bit more snazzy. You'll notice that there's a Customize tab as well. If I click the Customize tab, I can name my chart, I can decide where my legend appears in my chart, perhaps on the bottom, uh, perhaps uh, there's no legend at all. In this case, I want it to appear on the top right. And I can choose the color of my slices, so I can choose a slice and then specify what color it appears as or change the background color. Once my chart is completely arranged the way I want it to be, hit insert, and now you can resize the chart by moving your cursor over the boundaries, the edges of the chart gadget, and clicking and dragging. If you want to go back into your chart, simply click on the uh, chart name on the top left and choose Edit Chart. That brings you back to the chart editor. This has been a quick tutorial on how to insert and create and customize Google Charts in spreadsheets. Thank you very much.